mission updated mantis. Let's go see what that's about. losing health and just being over encumbered man that's so stupid Why do I? Why does this happen? No! Oh my god! Fuck! It's so annoying. I need to keep my fucking finger off that fucking button. Save the whole system. That's cool. Damn it, dude. Fuck, why do I always have contraband? Like, I somehow always get more, dude. I don't understand. Our scan detected contraband on board. Halt and prepare to be boarded. All illegal and stolen goods will be confiscated. Hostile 
What? What are you talking about? God, that's so lame, bro. Is that all that's here? Is just that? Shit. pay off bounties because apparently I have some but I don't know how to pay them off. Contraband on ship? I thought I got rid of it. What are you talking about? Man. What do I have on me? Like I don't understand. What? What contraband? Please maintain your current course while we scan your ship. Man, this is dog shit. I don't understand. Don't get it. I don't even have contraband on my ship anymore, and they're still after me. This is lame. This is so fucking lame. Dude. Look at Sarah talking shit. Yard. Permission to dock granted. I'm 
going to check out whatever this is. We must. This is murder. You're on your own. Wait, what? I What's happening? What's happening? In our new state-of-the-art star yard, we are Why am I fighting these people? Oh, this is bullshit. But well, whatever, we're gonna we'll fight our way through it. Protocol required. So this is the star yard Walter can't stop talking about. I can certainly see why. It's a monumental operation. This is nice, compared to a trident. This is the R&D department. Are you looking for the showroom? It's back that way. If you're here to buy a ship, this is not the place. And I am not the person you should be speaking well, to. Well, I am here um, to buy a ship. You seem to be lost. The showroom is back though. Really? If I were Tayo, I'd be very concerned about the news. Oh, Ooh, it shouldn't have me now. Oh, is it? I, I didn't know where that was from. It's funny. Man, I just came here to see if I could buy a ship and they started shooting at me, man. That's, that sucks. Think you're supposed to be here, huh? Hey, I need you to listen to me. Members of Constellation are held to the highest regard, yet you persist on making poor decisions I'm, that reflect listen, badly upon us. They shot me. Because you're bending over backwards to help me right now. They shot at me. Play, I okay. came out of curiosity. But some of these specs so impressive. My business is switching to Stroud Eggman. If you need anything, just, just ask. Sense. A pleasure to meet you. Hello. Mere Star Yard How you doing, and Paula? Systems. We may be new, but I think you'll see why everyone's talking about us. The other Star Yards have been in business so long that they're set in their ways. Take Deimos. They've been making spaceships since my grandfather's grandfather's days. So we looked at every facet of these elderly corporations for opportunities to revolutionize and innovate. If you don't believe me, see for yourself. Thank you. So, so what sort of ship are you looking for? Right away. See what you got. I am, man. I am building the stars. Yeah. Or wolf. Roanoke Narcissus Galileo Halsey Halsey 
jetzt? Nö. Nee. Nice to see you again. How can I help? Feel free to come back anytime. Oh. Stroud Eklund may be new. But it has allowed us to learn from... If you have your own ship, we're always looking for bulk resources. The Star Yards have negotiated a set price with the Trade Authority. Twice the market rate. Once you have the requested resources in your cargo hold, just return to me. We'll pay you the agreed fee and we'll send porters to pick up the cargo. If you deliver the full amount, there's a bonus in it for you too. Most contractors either represent mining companies or are miners themselves. But really, we don't care where you get the resources. So however you procure them is your own affair. As a first-time contractor, I'm required by law to let you know that every Star Yard offers the same terms. But obviously you should deal with us. Depending on your cargo hold size, you may need to make several trips to fulfill the order. So what we need is aluminum. We need a small shipment, 500 units of it. Come back later then. What we need. I have a feeling we'll see each other again. Maybe. Play your security people shoot at me again. I gotta go sell some shit before we continue. So that's why we're coming here. I, what contraband? I don't have contraband. Why does it keep saying that I do? I don't have contraband. I literally got rid of it. Where do I have contraband? Where? that where is the contraband where is it yeah but i can't it doesn't let me drop the key card or anything you know i've tried already and I, it just doesn't doesn't work so that hasn't counted in the past I have no contraband. I don't understand. Dude. This game is stupid right now. It makes no sense.
See, quest items cannot be, you know, whatever. So, cannot be removed from inventory. So, it can't be that. The other thing that I had, I fucking just jettisoned into space because I don't want to deal with that shit. And somehow, some fucking way, I still somehow have fucking. I don't get it, dude. I don't understand. Now it's telling me there's nothing. See, this shit is bugged, bro. What the fuck, man? What contraband? It says I have some on my ship. Where? I don't have any. What are you talking about? Our scan detected contraband on board. Fuck, man. Halt and prepare to be boarded. This is All dumb as fuck, dude. Goods will be this is really like. You're on the wanted list. Halt and prepare to be boarded, or we will be forced to open fire. Ever, man. So dumb. You see, security always gets. Yeah, whatever. Fuck off. Just hurry up. This shit is lame, dude. I get a penalty, XP penalty for fucking getting jailed too. Shit like this makes playing a smuggler type character fucking annoying and, and not worth it. Cause I can't smuggle nothing, dude. You get caught every time, like what are you supposed to do? Probably need a better shit, but like I can't even. All the ships I've wanted to buy, I can't buy them. Not anything you need to offload. Train authorities always want. I'm just gonna sell some shit because I got too much shit in my head. Recoup a lot of the shit I lost. I lost a lot of money. Stupid bastards just fucking taking me to jail and confiscating me and all that shit. I can help you with? I'm sure you can find something you like. I do, but you won't fucking sell it to me, bro. That says I don't have enough credits for, for sale, man. Expensive ship.
Alright, what where did I have to go? I'm like blinking out on fucking all the places because it's just I keep going to jail. And I might go to jail again soon right now too, because I made it back into the fucking restart territory. It's an autonomous one, which it says in the name. If somebody knows how to pay off bounties, let me know because I have no idea where I'm even supposed to go. Everywhere I go, it feels like I just get shot at by the Freestar people, which is, which is stupid because the Freestar is supposed to be my homies. One of the traits I took in the fucking character creation. And it's like, now they're just shooting at me everywhere I go because I, I got to pay off this stupid fucking bounty, but I don't know where to pay it off because the game doesn't tell you. Serious captain. I hope to see you at a much later date. Ah, uh, okay, Paula. Thank you. Dead space. What's up? Well, that was weird. I appreciate it, Paula. That's, that's good to know. Inside the bars. I gotta find a bar then. We're going to be visiting the Astral Lamp while we're here. I mean, that's a given, right? Now we're back on Nia. No worry. Your ship's good at it. Anything I can help you with? Got anything you need to offload? Trade with them. I'm sure you can find something you like. Why? A K 
Achilles, huh? Transpo. Thresher. That's kind of cool. But again, I'm not really feeling any of these ships. Right now. Let's go see if we can pay off this fucking fine, I guess. Because, man, really, really, really killing me here with all this shit. into some trouble. Word to the wise. You don't want a piece of that. <laughs> don't stop unless you're told to do so. You're lost. I have a job to do. It's a bounty on you. Get that cleared as soon as possible. It's good for you. That's what I want to do. New round here? Hmm. Make certain you familiarize your after all. Certainly. And for First and foremost, the interplanetary anyone caught transporting the substance through this checkpoint will be arrested. On my list of excuses for attempting to transport Aurora, that ranks a close third. <laughs> the other regulation you should be aware buying it from any other business or a I am informing you of this information. All right, then. That's it. Voli Alpha has a unique agreement with the Free Star Collective. We allow their ships to patrol the spaceways, and Neon Security maintains the peace within Neon itself. The only exception is the Free Star Ranger outpost located in the city. But Ranger Price fully cooperates with our department. Move along. How do I clear my bounty, lady? The rules are there for a reason. <clears throat> Follow them. Lousy? What the hell are you talking about? Do you have any idea? No. Uh Aurora is the number. Clinical study. And before. I just want to know how to clear First my bounty. Party. We're talking. Come on, lady. Stay safe. The oh, fuck, man. Well, that guard does not want to help me out. So I guess I got to go to the bar and find the terminal. Oh, boy. Want to challenge your instincts and hone those corporate skills? So, why did you drag me in here? You said you wanted to buy you something need to be nice. Independently for wealthy to shop here. You are. Yes. Do you think Can I, I help suddenly you? inherited a <sighs> Are you sure you're in the right place? You certainly don't look like one of our user clientele. What you trying to say, bro? There's expensive, and then there's the Emporium. <laughs> I take it from your tone I've made an error in judgment. Please forgive my disrespect. We have quite a few, shall we say, thugs that find their way into my establishment and create a disturbance. In fact, there's a particular Seoka member who calls himself Headlock, who repeatedly torments me by damaging my goons. The Seoka Syndicate, of course. I'm surprised you haven't run into no, any I've of run them. into a bunch of They're a group spacers of pirates, so. who use threats and violence Majority. to push their own agenda. Time. And honest people like me tend to suffer the consequences. They're based out of Neon, 
But no one is certain who runs the Syndicate. Could be anyone. Ah, yes, the authorities. Neon security. <laughs> Sadly, I think he's right. Neon security isn't going to do anything about the problem. Anyway, I've already taken up too much of your valuable time. Oh my goodness, that's such a relief. Headlock's quite a dangerous gentleman. I believe you can find him hanging out somewhere in Epside near Frankie's Grab and Go. No one knows. Seok are sleek, well-dressed mobsters. They aren't low-life gang members. Why they choose to hang out at a run-down little convenience store like that is beyond me. You say that, but Seoka aren't exactly pushovers when it comes to this sort of thing, so you better watch your ass. Anyway, that's really all I know. Head back here when you've taken care of the situation. Good luck. Okay. I'm sure you'll find the perfect gift. Gift, huh? Oh, so this guy sells expensive, overpriced, junky gifts, huh? Okay. Well, that's actually kind of cool, though. I'm not going to lie. But, what the hell am I going to do with that? Yeah, I don't have the money for some of this shit. Unfortunate. I kind of want to get rid of some of this shit because it's taking up so much of my inventory, but it's like not even worth selling. Oh, well, I sold one of those by accident. But it's not even worth selling because it just doesn't, the value, look at that. It's pathetic, dude. I believe he's a newer member of Seoka. They pulled him up out of one of the street gangs that crawl through our sewers. If you're wondering how I know about that, he boasts about it every time he comes in here. He's quite a large gentleman. I believe you can find him roaming the... Yep, told Look, about if that. he somehow disappeared, you'd be doing everyone in need. Please visit us again. Oh. And if you're in the market for luxury items. Yeah, I don't think I am, but uh... Good to know in case somebody somebody wants that or any of this. Something to when you have a moment. What's going on, Dewey? Hey, no funny stuff with that boost pack. Playing up light traffic. We're using the secret techniques of ancient earth. Hello and well hi there. <laughs> Welcome to Terra Brew. Terra Brew is like the Starbucks of this universe, so we're not don't need that. Housing here is so expensive. Welcome to Galvin, the cell systems premier financial institution. Yo, you have something going. Have you tried one of the advanced machines? Galvin ATMs are spread. There was a data breach and reassured its customers that their accounts have not been compromised. You don't want to pick a fight with me. Oh, yeah? Here Security the dudes think they're so tough, man. Enjoy yourself. I'm not gonna say this twice. Get the hell away from me. Rob, the shit out of that guy. Anyway, Astral Lounge. Here we go. Here's the bounty clearance one. Jeez. What? Come on, dude. Are you for real? I can't even clear my bounty here, bro. This is stupid. I swear, this game is this game's fucking me, dude. Imagine they're fucking me. They're fucking me. I finally find the stupid ass self-service bounty clearance terminal. And these bitch ass motherfuckers still won't let me clear it. They're fucking me, dude. They're doing it on purpose. They're fucking me.
I gotta go find free star people to do it. They said. What you said two drinks ago. Maybe you should slow down. Oh, well, let's find free star people. Because I can't do it at the stupid club, so I gotta go find the free star collective and clear it there. Hopefully, they should have an office here somewhere. Alright, what do you have, Sarah? Is it more fucking Sidonia botany? Is an industrial town. The people there tend to be. Oh, yes, of course. I almost forgot. Some nutrients, some sap she gave me. Until later. Sure thing, Sarah, sure thing. Man, they this is such a hassle to fucking Save clear your bounty, dude. Yesterday. This is annoying, bro. This is this right here and the uh, over encumbrance and the the bounty system shit is type of shit that makes me dislike these Bethesda type games, man. Oh, it's a clothing shop, though. Let's see what kind of drip we can you get here. To after work tonight? Nah, I'm feeling a little burnt out. If you don't see what you need, feel free to ask. Welcome to Sick Hearts Outfitters. Everything you oh, need be to explore shop. the set. Sounds like a good idea. Great. I can promise you, I'm not just using hyperbole to get your business. All right, well, I've what spent you got, years. Bro. It's fine. So take your time. Haven't heard that one before. <laughs> I have a lot of overhead in this place, and this is a prime spot right next. You'd think that, right? Unfortunately, I'm barely scraping by. Anyway, I don't want to bore you with the Yeah, I'm here to shop. So why don't you help out a poor So let me see what you got, brother. I'm sure we can make it. Let's see, weapons, he's got a cutter, space suits, I don't need any of that. Helmets, man, unfortunately, okay, let's see. Ugh. Jacketed leather. Corpo wear. Lame. And these futuristic suits and business wear is, uh, I don't know, man. Kind of, kind of weird. Oh, gosh. Look at that. Look at that headgear. Those are the dancers that we saw at the club over there. That's what they wear. Neon nightlife jumpsuit. That's kind of cool. The gold is a little much for me, but I like the black. I'm gonna just have to sell some of this shit because it's just in my inventory taking up space and I'm dying because I can't fucking move around anymore. That reminds me, next time I see a uh, workbench, I gotta modify this one because it's not my favorite.
Oh, I didn't buy anything off him, but I sold him a bunch of shit. Has really <laughs> to be that guy. He was telling me like, "Yo, I'm, uh, I got this, I'm in debt, bro. I got this nice spot, but like, I'm not doing too hot and everything. Like, man. Anyway." Finally, walk around without being over encumbered again. Too good for Neon. Sounds like she's trying to help someone or something. How are you? Hi. Excuse me. Days are too short. Life is too. Be. You lost, kiddo. Ah, just something I call everyone. Nothing to get worked up over. I had some high hopes for this shop back when my husband and I opened it a while back. These days, if you ain't a regular, you're usually trouble. And live in a UC? No thanks. Besides, I ain't about to let a few undesirables chase me away from what I've built here. Nice. Solomon thought a small convenience store with cheaper prices would make a killing. Of course, the only killing made was when he got himself shot in a robbery. Jeez. Now it's just me running this place, so you can see why I'm not a huge fan of strangers in my shop. So is he dead, or what happened? Just the usual. The usual, Never heard of him. Now, are you gonna buy something or just annoy me all I day? I literally just bought stuff off you. How am I supposed to know where he is? You're probably right. I'm trying to be reasonable here. You just won't give up, will you? No. Yeah, I know Headlock can't stand him. And I heard some of the other Sioka can't either. That boy doesn't know how to keep himself out of trouble. What'd he do this time? He's a customer. You're not here to interrogate me. Oh, so damn, I Paula. I see you track. playing The Sims. Hmm. Well. If any place should be terrorized, it may as well be the Emporium. Dang. In any case, if you're so desperate to find him, oh, there you are he again. and his friends are probably hanging out in Warehouse 4, somewhere near there. Warehouse 4, huh? I gotta ask, what are you gonna do with them? Depends on how, uh... <laughs> Let's see what's... I have no affection for him whatsoever. He's a good-for-nothing thug, and a boastful one at that. I wouldn't mind seeing him get smacked around and put in his place. But that doesn't mean I think he should be killed. <laughs> That's one way to punish him. <laughs> you'll just bore him to death. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a business to get back to. If you aren't gonna buy anything, you better. I run along. literally bought some digipics from you, lady. Come again. Like, I don't understand where her deal is. Gangs think they run this. I don't see. Ah, Anyang Asel?
Shame. Hey there. You're in the Vanguard, right? Hey, thanks for your service. Madame Sauvage's place. Look, I ain't gonna stand around here all day, right? You want the stuff or not? I'm still interested, but you're asking almost double to go in. Hey, what? get away from me. This stuff falls from the sky. Look, I've bought the war on the street before. Velocity's such, such a grab much. rush! Dios Dado's my dad's name. His dad before him. I used to go by Trey, but when the old man passed, I decided to do him a solid and wear the name without the neck. Even back on Seoul, my ancestors were island people. Voli Alpha being an ocean world, I feel their spirits with me. I'm a free spirit, yo. A wanderer. I go wherever the wave takes me. The wave, but if there's huh? two places I vibe with most, it's the bars and the market. Aurora's my mistress, but fashion's my heart, so I'm always checking in on the latest trends. Think so? I know people say the trends here are manufactured. Just more megacorp technorati bullshit putting commercials in the sky. But the corps can put up a thousand billboards, and they still won't define what lights up the street. We do. When I was a kid, my parents used to dress me in these hmm. old man sweatsuits because it was all we could afford. But even then, my sense of style was always there, deep in the marrow, you know? It got so bad, I started cutting up my clothes to make my own. When I finally could afford some new threads, it was like meeting my soulmate in person after a decade of loving her from afar. Interesting uh, choice of words there on that Zona. one. Nothing like the velocity after a rough shift of Makes you forget how bad you stay. And a second of chat? I'm in the market for a job that'll get me out of neon. If you need some muscle on your crew, I might be your girl. I think so. I've never been on one before, but mm. I'm a quick learner and I'm trained for combat. She is trained for combat. Space lanes are getting more dangerous every day. It might be nice to have a tough chick around, right? <laughs> Damn. I really thought that was a nice shot. Hey. Yes, what? This could have talked to her about second. Though. I don't know what you think yeah. you heard. But maybe there's places like this in Aquila, that's for sure. Love the vibe in this. What are you city. looking at? This? This is Ebside Striker's turf. Only the upstairs. Don't bother my customers. Fine, upstairs. That's gang territory, got it? Okay. <laughs> yeah, back in the day, you would never. Ugh. Yeah, you used to be people were afraid of the strikers. We had a name, got it? Now the disciples got us penned up in this lousy bar. Andrea. Fine, fine, fine. This beautiful establishment. Do you have anything else, or are we done with this? Whatever this is. We were one of the big dogs. We could take what we wanted and no one gave us shit. And Briggs? Total class act. Not a psycho like the disciples. Now look at us. I mean, the strikers will rob you blind, and if you back us in a corner, you're gonna bleed. But the disciples? Total nutjob animals. They torture people for kicks. And the only people that kept them from getting out of control? Us. And now we're all but ruined. So you stroll in here and want to meet with Briggs? The nerve. Maybe you should meet with the business end of my shiv, huh, tourist? No blood in my shop, Andrea. 
I am this close to tossing the lot of you out on the street. Get him. Fine, fine already. You're lucky. Only way you see. Then beat it. No customer. Bienvenue. Before you order, I have two simple rules you need to know. Oh, this is my place. That means everyone in here is under my protection. You don't mess with them, they don't mess with you. If you're buying drinks, you better have cash. Madame Sauvage does not offer credit. Good. Ça c'est bon? Oh, well. Thank you very much for the compliment. I'm told my family tree traces itself back to Europe, on mm. Earth. Specifically the region known as France. A long and proud history, no? <laughs> Finally, someone who listens and does what they're told. A rare commodity in Epside. I like you already. Mm. I can personally vouch for my colleague here and make sure that he behaves. So, what can Madame Sauvage get you? Have you come to try Velocity, perhaps? Or do you prefer something with a little less kick? Do you want information? Go read a book. You want a drink? Okay. Talk to Madame Sauvage. That's no information? With all these people here? Okay. Of course, of course. Rogies and gravy. Canuck Pilsner. Pinot Noir. Dark Lager. Pale Ale. Red Harvest. Milk Stout. Amber Ale. Pale Ale. A sandwich. Okay. Uh, Solomon's Reserve. Sparkling Water. Toast. Just a single piece of toast. Sparkling wine, velocity blue, velocity green. Alright, well, we don't need any of that. Au revoir. I just came to check this place out. Hey, I'm busy. Some. You want the good stuff? I'm zoned out of my mind right now. <laughs> you try a velocity yet? It'll change your life. Yeah, I'm good on that. Alright, let's go do this thing that I should probably... Warehouse O four. If you're not here to do business, you best leave before we get pissed off. I'm and who watching. do we have here? You here for business or to get your head caved in? Is that so? I'm not just some low-life thug anymore. I'm with the Sioka now. You mess with me, you'll mess with the whole syndicate, and that won't end well for you. Oh yeah? Those are big words coming from a nobody. So go on, Hotshot. Give me a reason why I should leave Tevin and his shitty little store alone. I... I think you're bluffing. There's no way you could take me. Think so? But fine. Nobody like you isn't even worth the trouble. We'll leave the Emporium. <laughs> Get punk, bitch. Whatever. 
Next time, I might not be so nice. Yeah, guy. Next time, there won't be a next time. If I see you next time, you're done. Back off. Oh, you better back off. Awesome, just punking dudes like that. Madame Sauvage. you care to pick up an exquisite gift? Oh my. Now that is a true relief. I thought I would never be rid of him. I'm not one to get involved with the rabble, so I'm glad you came along when you did. Thank you for your help. Come back soon. You never know what we'll have for sale. Look, man. Have a heart. I can't... Find this guy in jail, wherever he is. Security's got its eyes on Saburo Okadigma. Got some trouble for the status quo. Over here, Neon Security. Saburo Okadigma. Don't make my job any harder. No, no, no! Hey, wait! You were there? When those security assholes nabbed me? Yep. Please, have a heart. You need to help me. Am I guilty? No. I mean, yes, yeah, I'm hypothetically involved in Aurora smuggling. But who isn't, right? What's going on here is about more than some bullshit charges. I'll hear you out. Thank you. Oh, God. I gotta admit, I'm freaking out here. Don't do that. Just explain. That's my job situation I've lost my creds and if I don't square things with Yannick Legrand I'll lose everything else Yannick Legrand everything huh? Yannick is expecting a package a really not so legal package if you deliver to him he'll know yeah I'm allegedly real. don't worry Yannick's loaded he'll take care of you oh man you must still got space dust between your ears Yannick Legrand's got the best booze and refreshments outside of the Astral Lounge. And unlike Astral, it's priced for real people, not just corporate heels. And he's the maker of blends, so he's the man. In a kind of punch-your-face sort of way. I, uh, don't. But you are my last and really only chance. You are a regular lifesaver. You're solid. My crates on block O2 in Ebside. My authentication code is Alpha 3 Kilo 4. Alpha Just tell the manager four. it should key you in. The package is there, everything accounted for. Just take that to Yannick and hopefully this damn nightmare will be over. Okay. Alpha 3 Kilo 4. Not sure if those Varun zealots live in space or got separated from their home planet or what. They scavenge what they need. Lots of old facilities. Be careful around here. Sleep crates for rent. It's tight, but it's home. You have the proper authorization code, and I'll let you into any place you like. I might even throw in a thank you. You look like the type that might appreciate it. Mm -hmm. I got it, I got it. 
And... Authentication is all green. Look for C-153. C-153. Before you go, I'm going out on a limb here and assuming your account's more flush than my usual clientele. I've got some evicted crates set up to go to the dump. Might be full of weak old Kazimbas, or it could have the original Miguel Rafael Bailamos. Only one way to find out. A brilliant piece of art. It celebrates when the colonists first broke ground on Polvo. The vids make it look stunning. All done in charcoal from the embers of their first fire. Well, so the story goes. So they say. <laughs> nice to be able to use my art history degree for once. Hmm. Pro tip, when your parents say there ain't no use for a degree, they aren't lying. <laughs> Great. Unit C203 is now keyed to you. Best of luck. Dang, I just got fleeced. There's nothing here. Nothing but TP and a coffee mug, bro. I got fleeced out of 1K, man. Well, that's what happens when you gamble, I guess. some sleep crate units available for rent but someone like you trust me you can do better if you're struggling sleep crates are the budget accommodation choice it's tight it's got if you're in the market for a sleep crate good for you you can and it just so happens it's an artist's way of minimalism man I know what that is smart choice I'd say I got loads of crates for rent. For next time. Alright, well, let's go talk to Yannick. Legrand. The Grand's Liquors. The Coors. Paradiso. You good? All this time ah, we thought he was just customer. being so miserable. Feel free to spend your credits. You think he's or get the hell out. You'll pay. Years ago. Yeah? You need something? Oh, but you do. If you're here for blend, I just had a new batch come in last night. Oh. Huh? Okay, suit yourself. But you have no idea what you're missing. Look, I don't have time for chit chat. As soon as word gets up. No, are you crazy? I've got a captive audience here. Business is booming. Blend is part of the neon charm. It... Oh, yeah, right. You're with Nasher. I see the family resemblance. You're practically twins. What? I know he got pinched. So if you are some undercover, Yannick's no one. Well, Nesher wouldn't work with it. Huh, unless he had no choice. What is this about? Oh, really? Huh. 
fascinating. So Nesher came through. Eh, might be he's less crappy than I gave him credit. <laughs> Who am I kidding? He's a bottom feeder. But when all the good fish get gobbled up by corporations, sickly minnows are all that's left. Dang, dude. Take the credit. I am known far and wide for my generosity. Ask anyone. Yes, yes. He is loyal. Loyalty will be rewarded. You look like talent. Serious talent. And no one knows you. Yes. You are looking at the one and only maker of the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, the kick is the problem. Ah, <laughs> and smart. <laughs> I like you. What's the kick Blend here? needs Aurora, yes? And Aurora is totally illegal outside of the Astro Lounge. And really, really illegal off-world. If the Rangers catch you with Aurora on a ship, oh boy, that's a long time in the clink. And if the great Benjamin Bayou finds out you're selling it on the streets, even Benjamin bigger Bayou. trouble. Benjamin Bayou. But so far, I've heard of that guy before, I, I think, have right? outsmarted them all. And together, we can keep making loads of credits and making a fool of the great man Bayou at the same time. Very. Very good. Nesher's worthless to me now. Loyal, yes, but he'll be watched from now on. Useless. And my other employee, uh, Felix Sadler, makes Nesher look like a genius. I think it is time Felix Sadler takes a vacation. Permanent. Off-world. Or maybe he tragically falls into the ocean, I don't care which. But you deal with him, and you become very valuable to Yannick. Ah, Felix. Felix, hmm. he's been getting worse. And... Eh, it is called delegation. You make the right call, yes? As long as our hands don't get too dirty, I suppose we can help out this Yannick character. Felix sacks up in some dingy warehouse in Ebside. You will find him there. Eh? Yeah. I wonder if I'll even recognize him. Well, well, well. Let's go and see where this Felix character is. Oh, also, let me clear my bounty while I'm here. Three stars. This is what I was looking for. Good opportunity for me. So, word of advice: be careful whose bad side you get on. If you're here to report a crime, take it to local security. They handle that stuff. Mostly to keep an eye on the smuggling trade. Black market goods flow through neon like a river. Can't stop it, but I can at least keep an eye out in case it's something real serious. Later. Oh, who do I talk to to clear this goddamn bounty? Like, why is this so difficult? the only guy here? What the fuck? Hey. That is some shit. I'll tell you. Hey. 
If you're here to report a crime, take it. Think nothing of it. Word of advice. Trouble's waiting around every... Everybody should. There's something else you need? Nah. I'm the son of a Ryujin Industries executive. Maybe you've heard of her? Name's Alexis Price. There's a sort of fragile piece here in Neon. It's better for everyone if the syndicates and the corporations coexist with minimum friction. Believe it or not, my mother's an executive with Ryu. I volunteered for this post as much to keep the other rangers out of trouble as any other reason. If some hotshot rookie took this job and started... Stay out of trouble. Yeah, I don't understand, bro. They're really gonna make me go to Freestar Space and fucking do it that way. That's so annoying. Why? What's the point of having these goddamn bounty terminals if I have to go all the way to specific spot? Shit makes no goddamn sense. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Bad part of town, buddy. I'm gonna do you a favor. Head back to Bayou Plaza before the disciples get you. Hey, it's your ass, not mine on the line. Whole oh, area's coming to hell. Us crate rats used to think the Ebside strikers were awful, with all the muggings and shakedowns, but now that they're on the ropes, kinda wish they weren't just holed up in Madame Sauvage's. Streets are getting bad. Real bad. I mean, yeah, they'll rob you blind, but at least they let you live. They're bad news, but compared to disciples, positive angels. The lesser of the two evils, huh? Sure, sure. So, for being so helpful, what with the disciples? You can't blame a fellow for trying, right? Sarah disliked that, uh. Of course she did. Hi there. Now, why does, uh. Why does Sarah have to come around over here, man? She's gonna act like this, like a Billy Two Shoes guy. Just stay on the ship. Kind of busy right now. Let me be a fucking. Smart a scoundrel, that's the right word. You're done, hold up! Take him down. Oh. 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 I'm just I getting warmed up. Cry me for me, I swear! You were awesome! Did you see yourself? Those Seoka Syndicate freaks had no chance! Yannick came through! Like I have any goddamn idea. But they'll regret messing with Yannick, yeah? What? Yannick's firing me? That's what this is? Off-world? Just pack up and go? No, 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 that, that can't be right! Tell you what... Screw Yannick! I hope the Syndicate string him up and execute the bastard! And screw you t Oh, I feel so honored to know you and- Alright, whatever. Whoa, what? You wanna kill me? Gave you a chance, brother. You didn't want it. I gave him a chance, bro. I gave him two chances. 
two whole ass chances and he didn't he he didn't he didn't want it so okay pal take a shotgun blast to the face dude I was ready for that to happen he just wanted to die I guess today well he's out of the picture now I gave him an opportunity to leave bro I told him straight up I'm like, yo, this is this is what's good. This is the dealio right here. He, he wanted to die, I so that's on him. Sucks to suck, bro. How am I over encumbered, bro? Come on. What's up? You deal with Felix yet? I'm sure it was a great pleasure. He's an idiot. Shit. Shit. No, I do not. But I will find out. Not happily. Not many options. He does not hold up a candle to you. You get results. Like me. <laughs> well, hopefully not too much like me, right? <laughs> so, now, new business plan. Where I am the boss and you are my capable and well-rewarded underling, yeah? Yannick's blend is running low. Soon there will be angry customer, and that's bad for business. What we need is Aurora, and there's only one place to get that. Zeno Fresh Fisheries. Which is where? Nasher worked there and had a secret contact. Even secret from me, his good friend, who supplied the Aurora. Hmm. Maybe. No longer important. So, it is time for you to become a productive member of society and get a job at Xenofresh. I don't think so. And here are some superb and very legitimate credentials. And your new name is... Riley Chernyshevsky. Yeah, I don't... This is, nice this is much you, more Riley. than I <laughs> signed up for. So you apply there to work in production. Oh, uh, you know how to make amp, yes? Simple recipe. They expect applicants to know basic chemistry. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm, I'm not about this. Of course they will. Actually, associate. Oh, <laughs> you can try. So you need to put on your best suit, Riley, and make a good impression. Nishar's contact should be looking for someone like you. So, man, and I didn't agree to this. You good? I gotta tell you, man, this is the best. What do you mean, Val? He had, to, he, had he had opportunities. It's all on him. Welcome to Newell's. If you're looking for any specific goods, Rosa and I guarantee we'll beat Sieghart's lousy selection every time. Oh, I don't have a problem with this place. My problem is Sieghart himself. That man has absolutely no respect for the business community on Neon. He skips merchant meetings and refuses to participate in any of our group buys. Worst of all, he pays off Neon security to keep his place safe. Yeah, sure. If all you care about is yourself. Every payment Seagert makes validates Neon security's corruption. 
He's setting a bad precedent that many merchants are forced to follow. Mm. Anyway, sorry. I know I can get a little intense about these things. Little. If you'll forgive the outburst and have a look around, I'm sure you'll find something you might want to buy. Well, we'll see about that, but... Of course. I do have stuff to say. I have you. a huge... Which I'm going to do first, so you can have that. You can have that. Uh, have this because I don't need them. Axe, helmets, apparel. That. 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 Still over encumbered, huh? Man. Oh, I still have more stuff. I arrived in Neon almost, uh, what, 20 years ago? I had gotten a job at Xenofresh through a friend, started working on the loading docks. After a few years, they moved me up to Kazimbas Processing. And that's where I met Rosa for the first time. She was my supervisor, but we hit it off right away. It wasn't long before we decided to quit Sino Fresh, get married, and start our own business. We've been in love ever since. Oh man, what a what a touching story, huh? Aww. Uh I'd say the majority of the guards are rotten, and the few who aren't simply take a paycheck and look the other way. They have Neon completely under their control. The Freestar Collective's own security doesn't even maintain a presence here. If it wasn't for the Freestar Rangers outpost, there wouldn't be a shred of justice in this entire city. Dang. Oh. Okay. Yeah. That'd be extremely helpful. <laughs> I honestly don't know what to say. Fair enough. Just be careful when you're dealing with Sigurd. He can be surprisingly unreasonable when he's cornered. The first time I brought up the subject, we got into a huge argument. Sigurd said he had every intention of paying Neon security and that it was final. After that, I tried to speak to him a few times, but he's always been too busy to spend the time to sit down and have a decent conversation. It's obvious he has no intentions of talking to me anymore. I honestly don't know what I did to make him so angry with me. I had to chase more zone heads out of here today. I don't think they even knew what planet they were on. Welcome to Newell's. Let me know if you need help with anything. Do I sound that awful? I didn't even realize. Terrible, just terrible. I mean, I didn't You'll say You'll have to that. excuse me. With all the ruckus my husband's been making at the Merchant Alliance meetings, it's difficult to get any rest. Poor old man has himself mixed up in a foolish crusade against Dietrich Oh, Sitar, that's here, woman. Well, he's angry at for paying that's off That's why I'm here security. to talk to you about. It's a little group James formed, with some of the other vendors on Neon. I'd call it more of a support group. Because all they do is sit around and complain about how hard it is to run a business here. <laughs> For protection, I assume. They apparently target certain businesses with some type of safety assurance fee scheme. We've been spared that indignity so far. But it's absolutely disgraceful this kind of thing is happening. I agree. He runs Sieghart's Outfitters. It's right outside the spaceport terminal. I suppose you could say he's our only real competition. If you ask me, he isn't such a terrible person. Uh oh. Please don't tell James I said that. I don't believe he is, no. I think my husband has Dietrich all wrong. He's probably doing what he has to do to survive. Well, let's have a chat Just, with um, this fella. Please don't tell James I said that. 
I don't want him to think his own wife is doubting him. Hey. Well, thank you. I can't remember the last time a total stranger walked into our store and offered to help. It would be so lovely to see my James happy again. He used to smile at me all the time, you know. Now all I see is worry on his face. I suppose you can speak with him about it if you like. But perhaps you'd like to browse our store a bit before you do? Already did. Oh, he'll be so upset for me telling you this. But it's such a fun I mean, he already story. told me his side of the story, resist. so what's yours? James and I used to work on the Chasm Bass line at Xenofresh. We didn't do any of the Aurora extraction, just dealt with the leftovers. I was a supervisor on the line, and when the alarm went up that it had been stopped, I investigated. I find James inside a storage vat, up to his shoulders in stinky fish guts and blind as a bat. The gut got in his eyes, you see. I had to walk him to the showers, strip his work clothes and Whoa. hose him down. When he saw me standing there, he turned bright red. <laughs> oh, I can see why you wouldn't want that story ended, being told. After the went out for a terror brew and talked. A year later, we were married. <laughs> Better times. Better times. Dietrich is actually quite a lovely man. Though lately he's been under a lot of pressure, which has made him rather bitter. When we first opened our business here in Akuchi Market, he was actually very helpful. Offered us advice. Didn't treat us like competition at all. I'm sorry, I just don't believe Dietrich is doing anything wrong paying off Neon security. We all do what we have to do to survive I don't think that's wrong of him either. City. Unfortunately, my husband is convinced Ikuchi, that fighting City Paula. Hall is the way to solve all of Neon's problems. I that, think That's the wrong. market. Now, James, I don't want you to get upset. This is the market that we're in right now. That's what it's called. Catherine Lucian keeps demanding we look into her husband's murder. Alright, C card. We talked to this guy before. Come on in, please. Hello there. Let me know if you need anything. I've been at this location no, they're for the not, last Paula. eight years, but I've had a business in Neon for almost 20. As soon as Ryujin broke ground on the tower, I knew this. I love this business. My dear mother would have said the same thing. The fees, it has not always been easy. You won't find another store like mine. Yes, I'm aware of James's objections. That's partly why I don't go to the meetings. But if I don't pay Dexler, I'll lose my business. And what good for joining the Alliance do then? Dexler. So, really, I don't have a choice here. If they... Oven Dexler is head of Neon Security. But he is less concerned with crime Maybe than I can he is deal with siphoning this guy. money from honest businesses. But it's not just him. All of Neon is corrupt. The only way Shame. to survive is to give in to their demands. It's fine in theory, but this isn't New Atlantis. It's Neon. Corruption is an institution here. What can a single alliance do to stop what's built into the foundation? I don't want to seem like a defeatist, but frankly, it feels like a waste of time. You think I'm okay with it? I would like nothing more than to run my business free of Dexler's thieving. But what power do you... And why is that? Rosa said that? I remember when her and James first started. They were very green. Damn, it's all it took. was a different time. I'm glad I talked to her first. Okay, you've convinced me. I will stop paying 10 XP, baby. Let's go. Fee. 
and tell the Newells I will come to the next meeting. Maybe hey, snacks and drinks. And Let's snacks. go, dude. You can't stand up to neon security on an empty stomach. There you go. Good, good guy. Good dude. All it took was, hey, bro, your your competition's hey, wife said you're you're actually a decent guy, bro. That's all it takes. Fully stocked and ready to sell. Well, I'll be. And all you had to do was talk to him? Yes, sir. Meanwhile, I was so damn stubborn, I made this whole thing harder than it had to be. Given you almost went blind, working with half a kilo of fish cuts in your eye. Yeah, I'd agree. And I'd still be wandering around that storage vat helpless, if not for you. Thanks for your help on this. The Merchants' Alliance is finally united. I don't know if we'll ever get a fair shake in the city, but it's a start. Here you go. Hey, hey. Ooh, hello. Do I gotta level up or what, man? No? Damn. Ooh, I can do that. I think I'm doing that one next, and then... I want that one. Then I also want commerce. Man, there's just too many of these that I want, bro. Need like three level ups to get all the shit I want to get. Some bullshit. Kinetics isn't the 